15 April, five of us cycle to Puto village, Puto Chun. From JPCIQ, we are heading towards Langa Bay, direction 52, J1, then Route 1. Puto is 40 km from CIQ, so Route rock on all the way towards Senai and Kulai direction. Take note Route 1 is always packed with traffic. There are some sections without good shoulders and many intersections. Do look up for filtering vehicles. Route 1 and 3 are normally different from those routes leading to Bekulen, Okok or Pongtian. So newbies have to be careful. Leads have to shower the potholes to those behind. Turning right into Route 94, this is up slope and we have to cut across two lanes, heavy vehicle traffic. Puto village has a 800 meter elevation and I suspect 60% of those hills is in the last 10 km. Perfect for those who enjoy roller coasters. Jiayu. Route 94 is single lane, so we have to be alert. Vehicles are patient, but sometimes they will still overtake quite close to cyclists. Those hardcore folks will actually do the 100km triangular loop towards Uru Tiram or J8, more slopes.
ba? After conquering Route 94 slopes, we thought maybe last 3 km is relaxed already. J271 and even the Puto entrance will welcome you with more slopes. Welcome to Puto Village, take more photos and enjoy the giant landscape. Entrance fee is 10 ringgit. We recommend folks to start from the bamboo forest and walk down slope towards the Kwan Yin Tang. Clipless, take note, bamboo forest might be bandy. Kulai Huwazenji is just 5 km away. This popular eatery is next to a factory.
I hope you enjoy this video. Newbies can join Facebook group Cycling SG to Malaysia for orientations. Pop by my other cycling videos too. Happy cycling!